Why is it that everything is backwards and, and everyone makes it seem like, oh, just call this number, mm-hmm. you'll get your help, get into housing, you'll be good. And then it's not like that. It's really call this number, wait a thousand years, possibly, you know, if die they, before. If they answer. Die be- yeah, if, if, they, if answer, they answer. If they answer, your phone answer, call to tell you to keep waiting. To Cause that's what they're gonna tell yeah, you. Yeah, and, and then by the time like you don't run into so many problems, then you go to jail. Then you uh, now you're on probation. Now you can't leave the state. And then now you can't get a job. Like all because of yeah. everything is not fast enough. And you and get, everything is not efficient. You get so many t- t- like uh, parking tickets. You know, sleeping out in your car. So it's just like those add up, and they take you in over that. Mm-hmm. They take you over your tickets building up. You didn't even got necessarily be doing nothing to society. You just mm-hmm. you 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 just, broke. Just trying to exist. You broke in society. That's broke. what you getting arrested for. I know why I got for the sheets. That's on the um, I'm at the Walgreens on Main Street. Can you send a police officer over here? These individuals are stealing your makeup. There's like two people here stealing the makeup at the store without no shame whatsoever. It's a man and a woman. Yeah, one already walked out with a bag full, and the other one's in here. The woman is, is taking it. She's all dressed in blue. Now, she, now she's. The male walked out, now the female walking out. So I've been meaning to do a video about these two clips that I saw on Twitter. The first one, as y'all just got to see, my man and his girl sitting in lawn chairs complaining about the cost of living and people not calling them back from apartments. Um, this is probably going to be a short segment of this episode because I'm a firm believer if you have a partner, girlfriend, husband, wife, boyfriend, and you struggling, both of y'all deserve to struggle, right? Uh, you got a teammate. There's no reason why you can't like work your jobs, put your money together and make it happen. If he has like a fucked up criminal record, surely she should have a clean one. You go off of her criminal record, you get the apartment, you move in. If, if she got a fucked up criminal record and you can't get a spot because of her, then sir, you go off of your criminal record Do the background check for the application for the um, apartment and y'all move in. But being two people and you still struggling, you homeless, like you kind of deserve being homeless. I'm I'm a solo dolo person in Atlanta and I'm not homeless. Like there's no and I don't have no no significant other. Right. But if I did, I'd probably be doing a whole lot better. Right. Because I don't believe in struggling with a motherfucker. If we gonna fuck with each other. We need to come up. If we ain't coming up, we need to come out of this bullshit. Um. And then you have, which looks like probably 19, 20 year olds in a Walgreens, Rite Aid, CVS, some shit, right? Looting the place, stealing shit off the, the girl stealing all the makeup, about to boost the shit. And the dude stealing shit off the, off, off the shelves, right? Um, this right here is uh, high cost of living and inflation at work. The mech jobs and Taco Bell jobs and warehouse jobs. I don't give a fuck if they pay $19 an hour, $19, $20. They ain't enough. When you got people in L.A. charging 3000 a month for a one-bedroom apartment. And you got people in New York charging 4000 for a one-bedroom apartment. It's not enough. Now, I don't know what has to happen. I don't know if Biden needs to work out inflation or people in the private sector needs to need to bring down the cost of living and housing. Or private sector needs to bring down prices and shit like oil changes and food and clothes. And like, I don't know. What I do know is that this is going to continue to happen unless something is done. You can't keep having high cost of living and mediocre or medium wages. It doesn't work like that. Um, eventually, people are going to start jumping over the gates where rich people live. Uh, if it's not fucking with them now, uh, trust me, it will be fucking with you in the near future. Motherfuckers will be jumping over Michael Jordan's fence, Samuel Jackson's fence, Bill Gates' fence, and they'll be trying to eat you figuratively and, and literally. So, America, government, you probably got to work that out. No.